The Diocese of Greensburg officially has a new bishop. Larry Kulik, who is a Leechburg native, was installed today. Ross Gadotti joins us live with more on Bishop Kulik and the path that led him to today. Ross. Yeah, a very big day for the Catholic faithful in the Greensburg Diocese. There is a new bishop and he turns out to be a local guy. <laughs> With all the pomp and ceremony of the Catholic rites that spanned two millennia, a one-time kid from Leechburg became the leader of the faith and diocese he dedicated his life to. In the majestic Blessed Sacrament Cathedral in Greensburg, Monsignor Larry Kulik became the sixth bishop of Greensburg's diocese. Kulik, now the chief shepherd to a Catholic faithful, 78 parishes in four counties to include Westmoreland, Fayette, Armstrong, and Indiana. He faces many challenges as the leader of the faith here, COVID-19, financial issues in the church, priest abuse scandals and attendance, but while addressing these challenges, he also took time to address many people who were there for him today, including one very special lady. You know, many people think that this is an important day because it's the ordination and installation of the Bishop of Greensburg, but it's an important day because my mother, my mother was born on the street on Harrison Avenue at home. My mother has lived on the street 81 years. My mother today leaves the home for probably close to 12 hours, and I don't know what Harrison Avenue is going to do. And that's a historical moment. All right, Bishop Kulik, 54 years old. He plans on visiting all of the parishes in the diocese over the next couple of months. And he's a classic car aficionado. His favorite is 1966 Pontiac Le Mans. Pretty cool ride. Reporting live in Greensburg, Roscadotti, KDKA News.